What's up guys, Matt Montanez here again with another plugin in depth video. Today I'm going to talk about Waves Aphex Vintage Arl Exciter plugin. It's an amazing plugin, I love it. Well, I love all the plugins I talk about because I use them all the time. But this one in particular is great, especially on vocals. What this bad boy does is it enhances and it increases the brightness on vocals, like it enhances the detail of your vocals and stuff. So like, I know a lot of people are always trying to find like the crispiness and the EQ the heck out of their vocals. But a lot of times you can just slap this bad boy on there and it'll bring out what you need, that crispiness, that enhancement of detail. It's great, it sounds amazing. So I'm gonna play on this track right here that me and my buddy BK did recently, and it's great. He's an amazing songwriter, an amazing artist, and uh, we got together, did this song. I just mixed it recently, and I used this bad boy on it because, well, it sounded great, and it's what it needed. So let me get into this plugin and talk about all these little knobs and stuff, what you got here. First off, you got your modes, which you got a BP, mix one, mix two, and auxiliary mode. And your BP is the bypass mode, and that's basically like the SSL channel strip and the a, uh, API uh, plugin I used that I showed you guys that when you hit the bypass, it just bypasses what the plugin's actually doing, but you're still getting the emulation of the hardware signal of this. So if you hit the bypass on, you're at least still getting the hardware sound, but um, it's not really doing anything. Then you got two different mix modes. Uh, on the original hardware, you actually only had one mix mode. This one, they gave you two mix modes um, because the way you can run it inside your DAW, how you can slap it on the insert and really just use a mix knob and things like that. But um, it gives you different kinds of sounds. Basically, mix one is where you're mixing basically on the insert with this mix knob and it's blending the wet and dry signal. With mix two, that's the original hardware way where you would slap it on the insert and you would use the mix knob. So it's just a different kind of sound you're getting. The original hardware way. The mix one's the new, the new way made just for this plugin. And then you got the auxiliary mode, which you slap it on an auxiliary track. So it's similar to mix one, but you use a send to actually blend the two signals, the wet and dry signal. So um, for this song, I used the mix one on an auxiliary track instead of just like an insert, and I just felt like it worked for what I was trying to do. Then you got your meters, which you can change your VU meters to, to see the input, the output, or the auxiliary meters. And I just leave it on output. I don't really mess with that too much. You got an input gain knob, you got an output gain knob, and then you got your mix knob. And this works only when you're in mix one or mix two. When you're in auxiliary mode, it bypasses that because you have to use your send to blend it. Then you got your little analog section here, which you got, like my other videos, you got the 50 and 60 hertz, which just is the analog sound of like the power supply. I leave that off, and then you got your original analog noise, which if I boost it up, you can actually hear it quite a bit now. I always leave it off because when you're fading in a song and you have too many of them stacked up, you just hear all this noise, and it's very unpleasing to the ear. So I like to leave that bad boy off. And what a lot of people don't realize too on this plugin, uh, not on this right screw here, but on the left one, you can actually move it and what it does is adjust your VU meters. So you can actually show your meters to do 24 dB of headroom and go all the way down to eight. The default is 18 dB headroom. And that's something to keep in mind too. So if you want to change your headroom and see so it doesn't look like you're always just peaking in this plugin, you can change it a little bit. I'm gonna just play a snippet with the uh, two track going on here and just the loop of the vocal piece I got. And I'm gonna exaggerate the plugin for now and go between the three modes. Then I'll go back to my settings so you can hear the subtleness of what I did and how, it, how I used it to enhance his vocal. Breath of fresh air like I passed you a joint Either way, that's plenty of J It's BK, but you can't always have it your way Nah, no lies, no smoke and mirrors Restaurant says sorry, no smoke in here Laughed it off while we ordering dessert I'm about to order you, but I'ma let you order first Nice guys finish last, white wine in your glass Take my time, help you in the car, hand on your ass Nasty ass gentleman so as you can hear, like it's really adding a lot of brightness, so it's starting to distort and things like that. And it sounds cool though, you know, it sounds real cool. You can hear what it's going to do. So I'm gonna go back to my settings now and we can hear the subtleness. You got your mix one, which is just really, um, what I would say it's a lot cleaner than the mix two. So 
you're getting more of just the brightness instead of the whole entire body of the vocal because you got mix one which isn't giving me the full bodiness of mix two and um, you're going to hear that right now how it's just giving me a lot more of the brightness and the detail the crispiness I, I wanted for this track and then when I switch to mix two you're going to hear that it's going to give it some more body like a lot more body and then when I switch to the aux you're going to hear it's just going to give me the detail only. So let's go to mix one first, and I'm gonna toggle between mix one and the bypass. Breath of fresh air, like I passed you a joint. Either way, that's plenty of J. It's BK, but you can't always have it your way. Nah, no lies, no smoke and mirrors. Restaurant says sorry, no smoke in here. Laughed it off while we order in dessert. I'm a and you can hear it's just making it pop out a little bit, just that vocal, and it's nice, it's very pleasing. Let's try mix two now and the bypass. Breath of fresh air like I passed you a joint Either way, that's plenty of J It's BK, but you can't always have it your way Nah, no lies, no smoke in mirrors Restaurant says sorry, no smoke in here Laughed it off while we order in dessert I'm about to order you So you can hear it's doing something similar The same thing, but it's giving it a more full body sound So the way I like to see this plugin is When I use Mix 1, I'm going more top end brightness And when I use Mix 2, I'm going more the mid set Section. That's just the way I like to think of it. It's easier. So I like, okay, I'm going to use mix one this time or I'm going to use mix two this time because mix two, like I said, it always gives you that more body sound. And let's try the ox sound with the bypass back and forth. Breath of fresh air like I passed you a joint. Either way, that's plenty of J. It's BK, but you can't always have it your way. Nah, no lies, no smoke in mirrors. Restaurant says sorry, no smoke in here. Laughed it off while we order in dessert. I'm about to order you, but I'm. And for that one, you can hear that it's just giving me the detail, the enhancement of the plugin. So it's cool, it works, but it didn't give me everything I wanted. So I stuck with mix one for this particular track. Now I'm gonna go between all three of them back and forth. Breath the fresh air like I passed you a joint. Either way, that's plenty of J. It's BK, but you can't always have it your way. Nah, no lies, no smoke in mirrors. Restaurant says sorry, no smoke in here. Laughed it off while we order in dessert. I'm about. So as you can hear, I'm still getting that crispiness, that brightness that I want, but it's still giving me a little bit, keeping that body in mix one, which is great. But when I go to the ox, it's just all bright, and it's just too much for me on this track. So I left that off. So um, like I said, you can also slap this bad boy on the master track and I'll do that now so you guys can hear how that sounds and it sounds really, really cool. Like you'll hear that it's very subtle where it's going to make your track a little more crispy um, whenever you need that. Breath of fresh air like I passed you a joint Either way, that's plenty of J It's BK, but you can't always have it your way Nah, no lies, no smoke in mirrors Restaurant says sorry, no smoke in here Laughed it off while we order in dessert I'm about to order you, but I'ma let you order first Nice guys finish last, white wine in your glass Take my time, help you in the car, hand on your ass Nasty ass gentleman sounds about right Cruising through the city, smooth sounds all night Smooth operator, rising like an elevator on the ground like a crater Weed is different flavors like a pack of now and laters And trident layer She knows I keep a player Keeping one eye open like a raider Breath the fresh air like I passed you a joint So it sounds real good, you know, about right there Almost at five You can hear that it just brightened up the whole track overall And it came out dope so yeah, guys, it's an amazing plugin. Um, I hope you guys are using it or at least going to start using it because it'll really make your vocals a little more crispy and a little more brighter. And well, it's a it's a very good plugin. It sounds great. So I hope this helped you guys out a little bit or made a more understanding on what this plugin is doing. It's great, like I said. And um, I hope you guys keep creating music and add this into your template or start using it more and more often so you can get what you need instead of just EQing the heck out of your vocals. Lastly, guys, I want to give a big shout out to uh, White Wave. Uh, they gave me a sponsorship with International Delights, the Reese's. So they sent me this cool cup and some creamer and things for my coffee. So it's pretty tight, you know. I never had a sponsorship before, but this cup has a Reese's logo there. It has this cool peanut butter cup handle and everything. And um, while well, their creamer is really delicious and stuff. Um, really cool, you know. Never had it, like I said, a sponsorship before. And it made me really happy to just see this package on my front doorstep. <laughs> so yeah, all right, guys. Take care. Keep creating music and have fun with it.